Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm coming at you guys with a haul video and I'm super excited. I recently picked up some stuff from Urban Outfitters and Forever 21 and as you can see we also have a new backdrop which is an item that I recently purchased and I'll describe where I got that. So yeah, I'm really excited to be showing you guys what I got recently. Um, Urban Outfitters had a huge sale. It was like 40% off all their sale items. So I bought a bunch of stuff off of the clearance. Everything will be linked in the description bar below. If you're not already subscribed, be sure to click that button down below and don't forget to like this video. I really, really appreciate it. And yeah, without further ado, let's get onto this video. Okay, so first I'm going to be starting off with what I got from Urban Outfitters. The first thing I picked up is this plain purple shirt. I got this in a size extra small. I say what size I got just so that if someone is looking for a similar size as me, they know what I got and what worked for me. But yeah, I, it's just a plain purple shirt. I like this because I can pair it with pretty much anything. I'll most likely be wearing it with jeans or yoga pants, just like as a comfy top. And I'm really excited to pick this up because I like the color. A lot of my plain shirts are kind of boring, like basic whites or black colors. But I like that I could pick something up with a little bit of color. Especially for the springtime, I think that this color would look really nice. And this shirt was originally $24 and I picked it up for $5.99 with that 40% off what was already the sale price. So I was super excited about that. <laughs> The next thing I picked up from Urban Outfitters is this pink choker top. It's got that choker top that you can wear around your neck and then it's got like a deep cut. I think it's meant to wear like something under it, obviously since it goes down really low in the front. I'm just thinking to wear like a black or pink tank top under this but I thought this was really cute. I got this in a size extra small and it was originally $39 but I got it for $11. So, yeah. Next from Urban Outfitters, I picked up two cardigans. The first one I got is this ivory color. It is in the size small. It was originally $59, but I got it for $8.99. Wait, seriously? It was originally $59, but I got it for $17.99, so I thought that was a really good deal. Um, I've been looking for a nice cardigan that I can wear in spring and summer this year when the weather starts to get warmer. I live in Seattle, so it's always raining, but in the summertime, it can get pretty warm, like in the 80s, like 80 degrees. So I've been looking for a cardigan that I can throw on as the months get warmer and also for those like chilly summer nights. So yeah, I'm really happy with this one because I wanted something that was a little bit of a lighter color since I do tend to wear like a lot of dark colored clothing. I wanted like a white cardigan to contrast well with that. The only thing here is it has pockets, but that's actually something I really like because I can put my phone in there if I you know don't wanna hold my phone around. And it's also got these really cute slits so you can see details from my top or my outfit. And yeah, so this is the first cardigan I picked up. The second cardigan I picked up is this gray one. It's also a super simple design. Um, this one doesn't have pockets, which I'm kind of bummed out about, but it's alright because I got it for a really great price. Um, let's see. I got this in a size small. It was originally $49.00 and I got it for $8.99, so that was a huge steal. I'm super excited about that. And yeah, it's really comfortable, really soft. All right, the last thing I picked up from Urban Outfitters is this bralette. I wasn't really sure if I wanted to get this, but it was a really great price. I, um, let's see, I got this in a size small. It was originally $24, but I got it for $5.99. So, yeah, it was a really great price, so I was like, uh, I might as well order it, see what it looks like. I can always return it if I don't like it. I thought this would be really cute to wear under the pink choker top that I showed you earlier, but after trying this on, I didn't like how the, I didn't like how the padding in here was so pointed. Like, when I wore the pink choker top, 
the bralette made it look as if I wasn't like really wearing a bra. And also when I was trying to slip this on, because there's no clips or anything in the back, as you can see it's just all string, and the string is really tight so it's really hard to slip this on because there's no way to undo the strings and they're really tight. I felt like I was almost going to break this because it was stretching so much when I was slipping it over my head. So yeah, I had to be very careful when I was trying this on because I definitely think I'll be returning this. I'm not that happy with it. Okay, so that's everything I picked up from Urban Outfitters. Moving on to the backdrop. I'm super excited I was able to find this tapestry online. It is from the website Society6, which I will link down below. Everything that I mentioned in this video will be linked in the down bar below. I wasn't really sure if I would like it when I saw it online because it's a website, I couldn't really like go into the store and see it. So I was a little bit hesitant when I ordered it, but when it came in, I was super happy. As you can see, it's great quality. That was the main thing I was concerned about, whether it be like too thin or not that great of like quality in general, but it isn't. It, it's great. The design is exactly like it was on the website, which obviously is really important. And overall, I'm just really happy with this tapestry. Um, I really like the pink details and all the flowers. I think it adds a really nice background to my YouTube videos. So this will be my backdrop for most of my YouTube videos from now on. Previously, I just had like a plain black construction paper background and that was kind of boring so I was like, you know, I really want to find a nice tapestry that I like that I can put in my videos and yeah, I'm really glad that I was able to find one and I would definitely recommend Society6 to for any tapestries because their quality is really great. Oh, and for anyone who's wondering, this tapestry was $33. They did give me a 15% off discount for like your first purchase or something like that. And it's free shipping. And all right, the last two things I have are from Forever 21. They're both denim products. Um, the first one is this jean jacket. It's just a plain, a little bit oversized jean jacket. I did pick it up in a medium because I didn't want it to be too tight of a fit. And I've been looking for a jean jacket for a while now. I've never owned one. Maybe, okay, maybe like the last time I wore a jean jacket was in third grade. But they've been really coming back in style. I've noticed a ton of YouTubers wearing oversized jean jackets. And I was like, oh my gosh, that's really cute. So I want to pick up one for myself. So this one was from Forever 21, as I said. I don't know if I'll be able to find this exact one on their website, but they do have a ton of plain jean jackets. They also have some that have embroidery on them if that's something you want. So I'll try to link a similar jean jacket down below from Forever 21, but yeah. I would definitely recommend checking out Forever 21 if you are looking for a jean jacket because they can get pretty pricey at other stores. I remember I was looking at Nordstrom the other day for one and they were getting around like $100, but I was able to pick this one up for $25-ish which I think is a really great price for a jean jacket. It's got two pockets in the front, as you can see. I think it's overall really nice quality. It keeps me warm, which is important, especially since I live in a chilly city. So, yeah. And the last thing I picked up was another denim product. This is a denim skirt from Forever 21. I've been looking for a denim skirt for a while as well. I know that Brandy Melville has some, and I like those, but I was able to pick this one up for a really great price from Forever 21. I think it was around $15. Again, I don't know if I'll be able to find this exact one on their website, but I'll try to link something similar down below. This denim skirt is really simple. I like the length of it because it's not too long or too short, and it's got two pockets in the back. It's really similar to the ones that Brandy Melville sells, so if you're not able to find this at Forever 21, definitely check out Brandy Melville because I know they have a lot in many different colors. I think this will be really cute to pair with some of the tops I showed earlier, maybe like the purple top from Urban Outfitters and the cardigan that I picked up. I think that would look super cute together. I'm just really excited for the weather to warm up so that I can start wearing all of these things. Because right now it's still in like the 50 degrees, which I think for me personally is too cold to wear shorts or like a skirt or short sleeves. And it's like raining every day here, so 
yeah, that's a bummer, but it will get warm soon, and I'm really excited for that because then I can wear all these new clothes. <laughs> so yeah, that's the end of my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing the things that I picked up, and again, everything will be linked in the down bar below. Again, if you're not already subscribed, be sure to hit that button down below and like this video if you liked it. I would really appreciate it. And until my next video, I hope you guys are doing super, super well, and I'll see you guys later. Bye! Thank <music> you.